Day Z, we're doing a little bit of a different theme today. We're going to go over sharp little objects like knives and stuff and kind of talk about, uh, I guess, their sort of bleed damage. This was kind of brought up where somebody was like wanting to, you know, see what could inflict the longest sort of pain and everything like that. So I picked a series of items that might not all be in the game yet at this point, but I thought were kind of sort of bleed ready and yeah holy shit the fray rate is tanking so let's start with the brass knuckles so uh yeah these guys they have a swing time of 0.5 seconds they're blunt they've got negative 25 health and they cause negative 5 blood and they have a 10 percent bleed chance i was like why brass knuckles because i mean they're kind of something that you could really cause a little bit of a bleeding with if you get people with it at least i think so uh, next is the crowbar, which, believe it or not, you could kind of slice people with it. Uh, it has a swing time of 0.5 seconds. It's got negative 20 health, uh, negative 20 blood, and it has a 60% bleed chance, which is a lot of bleeding. What is this? Is this a oh, somebody was here. Oh. Somebody was here. Did they close the door and run away? Is that what happened? Is that what it Because I wasn't really paying attention. Hmm. Was there somebody just here? I yeah, know, the zombie would have been. Maybe. I guess maybe not in the rain. It's a busy town. Pippin's up. We'll get back to the topic shortly. Oh, press ballistic vest. Can I wear that over what I'm wearing? I don't think so. I'm going to drop that. I kind of want the dress shoes, but I'm not giving my red kicks up. I guess that's just like a radio on the shelf. Alright, cool. So, we went over the curl bar. Next up is the shovel with a 0.5 swing time and negative 20 health and negative 20 blood and another 60% chance of causing bleed. Pretty cool, eh? Pretty cool indeed. Next up is the cleaver. And again, they might not all be in here, guys. I future proof these long guide ones just based on everything that, like, statistically could be added. That way I don't have to redo it or something. So this is 0.5 swing time again. This seems to be common in this stuff. Uh, negative 50 blood, negative 40 health, and a 100% bleed chance. So if you're wanting to cause a blood, bloody time and a blood and good splurting, the cleaver is a good way to go. It's a good choice. Uh, next up we have the combat knife, 0.5 swing time again. Negative 20 health negative 20 blood and a 100% bleed chance. A 10 and a kush kush what, what is this? I don't know what it is. I don't really care. Performance is just chugging. Oh, hell yeah. Sorry, Pippin. Yeah, okay. Did it go into my inventory or the ground? Did it vanish? Okay, this needs to be open all the time. Why is it not opening? Is it the intense lag? Open the backpack. I don't care if it's soaking wet. Alright, well. That's cool. Wait a sec, can I, like. Hmm. Yeah, can I put it, like, here? And then go, like, this. And then hold it and kind of reload it. Ah, crap. Nope, that's not it. Nope. 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 Ah, 
Son of a bitch. <laughs> Why would it close itself anyways? Come on, I want to use that gun. <sighs> oh, there we go. Nice. Alright, let's so get the gun out. Oh my god. They've got to do something about this. Okay. Not the pause button. So we got this opened again. I don't know why it closes. We've got this. And it shoots with apparently a silencer type sound. That's great. So we've got a gun now. That's good. Do we go over the combat knife? Can't remember. We'll go over it anyways. Uh, 0.5 swing time, negative 20 health, negative 20 blood, and 100% bleed chance, obviously. The fire axe, which is a very powerful weapon. 0.5 swing time, negative 100 health, negative 150 blood, 100% bleed chance. AKA, it hits you, you're gonna bleed. And you're not gonna be able to say, I ain't got time to bleed, because you're gonna be bleeding. That's just how it works. It's like an Asgard, but you'll be dead, I know. Then there's the farming hoe, uh, 0.5 swing. Negative health, 50. Negative blood, 50. And 100% bleed chance. You know, I wouldn't have included the swing time if I would have known how like unimportant that is, it seems. But we're going with it. Okay, I don't want to deal with generator. So you put in the spark thing, and then, yeah, okay, I'm not dealing with that. Cool. Is it just me, or is it, like, darker out? Is that a person? Nah, it's a zombie. It's hard to tell with the slow loading. Okay, so this is the fire station. We have to be careful here. The hatchet. Negative 50 health, negative 50 blood, 100% bleed chance, and 0.3 swing time. I guess the swing time does matter now. Who's laughing? Not I. Not I. I don't know if I've actually, like, I think I've been in it, but I haven't done a specific video showing off the, uh, the new firehouse. Range finder. Can't see shit in here. Can't see anything. Yeah, it's probably a bad idea being in here in the dark. This is just not a good display of this thing. Fire axe. I could use that for fire on the fire barrels. Hiking pants. Should I grab the fire axe? Yeah, I'd rather have like a splitting axe or something. But good timing with it coming up earlier in the video. Uh, I can't do this justice in this terrible light and performance problems. Like crippling performance. Uh, the hay hook, 0.5 seconds, negative 20 health, negative 20 blood, 100% bleed chance. you always going to be bleeding. Let's see what else we got here. We still got a lot of these to go through too many actually. Uh, we've got the hunting knife, uh, 0.5 we got negative 20 health, negative 20 blood, and 100% bleed chance. Obviously it's a big knife and it's for hunting so it's not gonna not make you bleed. Well, I guess I need water. Fucking irony of that. There's trees in the middle of the street. That a zombie. I'm gonna go get some water as soon as I Find a place to sit in. Can't see shit all in here. Alright. I think this is a good time to crack open a, uh, peaches. With the steak knife. get some food going on here, right? The ice pick. A point seven second swing time. Now when Laura Croft's got it, right? And, uh, we're getting a negative 50 health, negative 50 blood, and 100% bleed chance. Then we have the kitchen knife. 0.5 seconds. Negative 20 health, negative 20 blood, 100% bleed. 
I don't want to vomit, so. Good, we'll do one more while we're here. The machete. Negative 40 health, negative 50 blood, 0.5 swing time, and 100% bleed chance. Good thing I'm not putting images over top of these because I have not been setting it up well for that. Oh, bandage, cool. Take that. Never know when you need to bandage her up. How are my food and water going down already? I just ate like half a can of peaches. School backpack, and well, that's adorable. No, oh, thank you. Baseball cap. Do I have to eat more peaches? I'll do it in a sec, I guess. There's rain hell. Oh, we've got the pitchfork, which is 0.5 swing, negative 35 health, negative 35 blood, and 100% bleed chance. Lots of blood. This was really cool when I could see what was going on. Woman suit jacket. <gasps> Cereals. Because I'm a serials killer. I can't see anything. Can you? I can't. Maybe it'll look brighter on the YouTubes. I don't know. Eat my peaches, though. The screwdriver. 0.5 seconds. Swing time. Negative 20 health. Negative 25 blood. 100% chance of bleed. Screel. Scree sick. The sickle. 0.5 swing. Negative 20 health. Negative 20 blood. 100% bleed chance. The spear. Uh, negative 35 health. Negative 25 blood. 100 or 0.5 swing time. 100 swing time. And 100% bleed chance, obviously. I can't see shit. I can bring out the flashlight, I guess. That might bring unwanted attention. There we go. That's better. As we go into like one of the populated buildings. Surprised we haven't seen anyone else though. There's gonna be people all over this considering what kind of place it is. So like I've always mentioned, these sheds are absolute gold mines for items. Absolute gold mines. Yeah, it's just my light reflecting. Power generator. So many new items. So went over the spear. Uh, the splitting axe. 0.5 second swing. Negative 50 health. Negative 50 blood. 100% bleed chance. A lot of them always cause a bleed to them. It's pretty crazy. I forgot they just climb over the fence. Shit. Got a bad feeling about this. Oh look, a well. For my thirst. I don't want the fucking baseball cap. Alright. We'll deal with that later. I just want to get my water up. So we went over the splitting axe. Then we have the steak knife, which is our friend. Uh, 0.5 swing. Negative 20 health. Negative 25 blood. 100% split chance. Oh shit. Oh jeez. Oh no. Oh god. Oh jeez. Okay. Well. Someone's a little aggressive tonight. Eggs in them. Oh shit. A police station? That's not good. That's not good at all. People are usually in these. Why isn't the fucking door closed? Oh my god, this fucking glitchy game. Ow. Why is he going the- I- I am beyond puzzled. I need a safe building. To hide away from this bad performance and these crazy zombies. 
Are the doors closed? Okay. I feel kind of safe now. Leather sewing kit. Okay. Head torch. Those definitely seem more available. Whew. Well, that was exciting. How am I doing on health? Pretty good. And we got the sword. Two seconds swing time. But negative 50 health, negative 50 blood. 100% bleed chance. And it's historical. Finally, we have the chainsaw. 0.5 swing time, negative 50 health, negative 500 blood, and 100% uh, bleed chance. So that's pretty cool. Those are the sharp objects I identified. I hope that's a bloody good indication of the blood factor. So we're going to go and we're going to try out that police station again. Which is probably not a good idea, but... You know, whatever. Never been one for the grandest of ideas, I'll tell you that much. I don't like that there's a ballistic press badge, or press vest right in the middle of the fucking area. That kind of scares me. Okay, door. This time, I need you to actually close. Thank you. As I accidentally lock myself in with maniacs. I can see that being the case. Okay, let's look around. Should I bring out my gun? I don't know, it's probably fine. Anything cool? Nah, it doesn't look like it. The key is to be very, very quiet. Uh, I mean, if I, go, if I ran up on somebody, I guess they'd just shoot me, wouldn't they? Shoot right into the light. Wouldn't really have much of a chance to switch things. No, nothing. Somebody could be long gone, I guess. Seems pretty looted. Quiet police station, eh? I think we'd be busy. Wonder if anybody's out there. I guess I can chat in. Is anyone out there? I doubt we'll get a reply. Guess we'll head over towards the lumber yard. Kinda like really spooky. Oh wait, is there handcuffs? I really wanted handcuffs. Sub zombies. I'll just be on my way. So yeah, we're in like the far side of this place. I don't think there's like a church, but there's never anything there. I guess we're gonna hook around the road and kind of uh chill at that one spot. It's like a counter. Oh shit. Okay, well that's not good. Mm, okay, that's a little bit short of where I wanted to go. Let's see what we got in the way of side houses. Nothing there. Oh, <gasps> another holy shit. What is that in there? No time for that now. Crazy ass zombie just jumped inside of a fucking train to get me. Ow! Okay. I guess the zombies are smarter than we give them credit for. This is still following. I don't know. Box and light bulb. Useless. Useless items. Well, useless in the sense that I don't exactly need them for what I'm doing. So we got a dock up here. Why would somebody even go up there and just like, like monitor what's happening in the shipping yard area? There's good shipping yard stuff somewhere around here. I don't know. Might be a building nearby. It's just like there's a lot more to collect now that we're in a more uh, full economy world. It's nice to see that out there. And then I guess at this point we're going to head north again. Let's see what we're going to find. Probably nothing too exciting. 
it's the debate of kind of like chilling around these houses and looking for a car or moving forward and looking for a car or trying to set up a base and it's a weird balance and I'm not exactly sure what I'd like to do with it at this point but yeah there's a lot of stuff to do and this is like a really creepy one this whole night thing I'm glad I'm like somewhat equipped for it I'm just surprised at like the intense usage of my food and stuff while doing this hmm well, that's the day Z. It's nothing too exciting this time. <laughs>